how you do and thanks for tuning into my channel if you're new here welcome if you're a returning subscriber hey y'all so today guys i just wanted to show you this purse i got um about a month and a half ago now yes it was definitely in november when i bought this bag and i haven't been consistent with my videos so yeah i don't like film the minute i get something so i don't know if you'll still be able to find this purse I do apologize for that because I should have put y'all up when I found them. I live in Indiana and we have Myers in our state. Myers is like Target and Walmart. They sell groceries and they sell clothes and auto stuff if I'm not mistaken. Okay, but anywho, <clears throat> I'm sorry y'all. My voice is still not all the way there, but I'm getting better. Sound better than it did last week, that's for sure. So guys, this reminds me of a YSL bag. And I can't even say it's a bougie on a budget bag because, well, I guess I could because it looks a little bougie, but it was definitely a budget buy. There is no name on this bag. I love this color. It's perfect for winter, in my opinion. You can extend the strap if you're tall or you can double it up like I do if you're short. This bag was originally $38. However, I think I only paid like 20 something because... If you shop at Myers, you earn bucks. And I had some bucks plus um it was on sale. So it has a beautiful maroon color, y'all. I love this maroon and gold together. And then this is what the interior looks like. So we are going to close this one back up. Because y'all, when I see something good, I don't get just one. Nope, I sure don't. I get two. <laughs> so I do have two of these beauties and I have it stuffed. I carried this today. I had to go and take my COVID test. So I carried this today. But before I get into what fits, guys, I was sent a product from iMethod Beauty. It is a um, brow stamp. Let me get it. Okay, so iMethod, I first saw them on Instagram However, you will see them on Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube. They also have a Facebook Messenger, so I'm sure they probably have a Facebook page. I didn't see them initially on Facebook, but I had been seeing this company around Instagram. So when they finally reached out to me and asked me if I would do a video, I was like, yeah, why not? Because I literally been peeping that brow stamp. <laughs> yeah, I am horrible at doing eyebrows, okay? My eyebrows be looking like who did it what for and why. But I am gonna be in certain photos. Um, I tried it out. Yes, I did. It comes with 10, well, actually 20 stencils. So let me make sure again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, it comes with 20 stencils. One is for your left eye and one is for your right eye. And these are the two that I tried. One is called Heroin and one is called Confident. Y'all, I suck doing either one. When I first tried this one, I'm going to insert a picture. Don't laugh. Y'all see that picture look horrible. And then I tried this one today. Not too bad. I'll insert a picture of me with this one on too. So how it works, and I'm just going to do it on my hand. Just so y'all can see that I have inserted pictures so I'm just gonna rub it around in there so you would place the stencil and you would just dab and if you feel like you don't have enough you go back in I'm rubbing it around and you just dab now it did move so it's not perfect and I'm hoping you guys can see that arch a nice clean arch my hands are definitely ashy y'all see that eyebrow I hope <laughs> oh I can't see though to see if y'all can see it let me see all right and you can see where I double pa um, padded it at but if it was sturdy it would just be a nice clean arch so we're gonna try again 
gonna rub it in. I wish I wasn't so ashy. Oh yay, hold that in place. You guys, if you hear noise, my son is home and he has his TV on sky high. Oh my God, did y'all just hear him? And there you go. All right, back to the what's in my bag. <laughs> so I will leave the information below for this product. If you suck at doing eyebrows like me, you can follow them on Instagram, TikTok, or YouTube, as I stated earlier. And it comes with 20 stencils, like I stated, a left and a right eye. And I think it's, in, it's real inexpensive, kind of like $12 to $16, I'm not sure. Um, I didn't have to pay for this one. So I really don't know how much they cost, but I will go look online and see so that um, I can put it in the description box. Okay, y'all? And let's get this out the way. Oh my God, he has that music so loud. And I'm hoping my video is not picking up that music he playing. guys again um <laughs> i didn't say the whole thing and i had to pause this video so i don't know where i left off at anywho this is called i method beauty the color i have is number six and it comes in a few different shades and um you just stamp your brows on in a few seconds this bag holds a lot to my surprise y'all i did not think this bag was gonna hold as much because of this little divider here but when i tell you baby showed me she can hold a lot she showed me she was definitely a good investment so first things first i have my planner my receipt book let me move this bag out the way all right we're gonna bag her up and hopefully everybody can still see i know y'all what is that this is a wellness planner i haven't started writing it yet I found this at five below and I thought it was cute because it say this year I love to I'm looking forward to I need to fitness goals um, this year's resolution a goal tracker your goals for the week steps to get there the milestones your habit tracker um, reflections on the week things you're grateful for what you enjoyed what you accomplished silver linings and mindful moments and then it just starts over so I will be writing in this book this year. <clears throat> Just ain't been doing nothing. So I've been in the house starting off the year. The whole year so far I've been in the house. Went to the grocery store and to get a COVID test. That was it. So I ain't really got nothing to write. <laughs> All right, next y'all. Some lotion. Mm, 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 which I, oh, that's too much, but I definitely needed this. All right, so we got my lotion, which is one of my faves. If you this is one of your faves, please let me know. It is the Aromatherapy Eucalyptus Spearmint by Bath and Body. Y'all, I love putting this on at night before I go to bed. And then spray a little um, Bond Number 9 Greenwood Village with it. And put on some of that Dr. Till Eucalyptus Bath Oil. It's not bath oil. It's just regular body oil. Mm, you smell so fresh, so clean, so good. You definitely getting ate up. Definitely when you getting ate up. Hopefully no kids watching the video. Anywho. <clears throat> Next I have some fruit snacks. <laughs> I gotta be good. I'm letting my personality show too much. But that's just me. And you can't hide who you are. Because it's gonna show and I just have my wallet, cash envelopes, of course, you know, money, well, digital money, and that's it. No cash, because I emptied out my wallet the other day in my cash talking video. All right, next I just have a pouch from um, Macy's. Thought it was cute for the little red and cherries. 
and it is from Valfrey. Uh, most people like to see what's in them. I forget about that. <clears throat> so I have Kleenex because my nose was running like water. I have some eucalyptus um, spray. Advil. I am not on, but this was already in here when I grabbed the pouch, you know, so I just left it in there. Some body wipes, lip gloss, chapstick, and my fave, Mason Francis Kirk John Gentle Fluidy Go, and some more medicine for being sick, <clears throat> which I probably need to take some before I go to bed tonight so I can wake up feeling refreshed in the morning because I'm back to work in the a.m. All right. Um, now this has some cash. My cash envelopes. I ain't been nowhere to get no fives and ones, so there's nothing in there. My eyeglasses. Oh, this should have been in there. This is a MAC pencil. I, I don't know what color this might be, y'all, because look at the pencil. Um... It's like a reddish brown color. I don't even know why that's in here because I wasn't wearing nothing to match that. So we're not gonna even put that in there. We're gonna stick this right in there and move right along. Next, my keys. And there's nothing in this pouch except for my, um, my little emergency money. Next, I have a um, hand warmer, and you just turn it on, and it, I'm talking about it does get your hands warm, and it's also a charger. I have so many portable chargers, it makes no sense. My taser. Not dead. Medical cards, of course. And yes, it's hot stamped. They didn't have any hearts. So y'all, when I got my key pouch hot stamped, I wanted it to have J heart B. They didn't have no hearts. Because that was my thing. Even on my um, graceful, I have it, it's J heart B. But they didn't have the heart. So I should have known then not to get it hot stamped. But I did anyway. Then I have a little cereal bar. Yeah, I try to keep snacks in my purse. Even when I don't show them a lot of times, I'll be like pulling them out. But I am one of those people who, and this is a tool pen, who keeps snacks in a purse? Because you never know when you might be stuck somewhere and you hungry, you can't eat. So, you know what I'm saying? You got to have something. And I hope, you know, those who were stuck on the highway have decided to do different things with their car. And this is just some change. Maybe keep an extra blanket in your car, um, a small little candle, something like this that you can put in your armrest if it gets cold and you can have some type of heat going in your car some water and some food because in my car as we speak is waters a whole case of water they might be froze they might not be i don't know who cares because all you gotta do is bring them in the car turn the heat on bam they gonna thaw out i got a layer it's like a little shawl to put over me in case i get a little cold i have some gloves in there a hat because i don't really wear gloves and hat on the regular but in case i'm out and about and i need to put on extra layers i have that in my car I have pads and tampons, um, things to wipe off with, little body wipes, at least two of these, maybe three in my armrest. Yeah. So as you can see, this holds a lot. So it has a zip pocket and then it has two front pockets. So this little purse, I'm not tripping on my 30, well, it wasn't even $30. Well, both of them together might have made $30 because I bought them on the same day. So for the value I'm getting. And this leather, even if it ain't leather, it is so soft. Like, I do know what Chanel bags feel like. And it is soft, like a, a Chanel or a YSL, you know? No, again, it don't have YSL. Kind of looks like one, but it's a lot of stuff that look like things that ain't them. But we still buy it. So, with that being said, I'm going to put my stuff back how I had it because I just wanted to show you guys what fits in this bag. I will, if Myers, I'm going to go on Myers' website before I upload this video. And if they still have these bags, I will 
put Meyer.com down there so you can go and find out. I will link the bag if I can. I will link it so that you can get this bag if this is a bag you truly want. Trying to see if that'll fit, but it won't fit in the pocket, which is okay. It don't have to. However, I know my keys will. All right, so we got that in there. Put my taser back. Y'all, one day, let me tell you about this taser, okay? <laughs> I had the taser in my bag. Then my bag was kind of stuffed this day. And all of a sudden, I put one more item in that bag. And why did I do that? That taser started zapping. I didn't know what was zapping. And then, babe, like, don't you got a taser in your bag? <laughs> Maybe that's what it is. I was like, oh, my God, I forgot all about that taser. I was scared to reach my hand in there because I didn't want to get tased because I couldn't see it. Because it was so much stuff in the bag. And that is how that goes. And as you can see, wait, hold on. Where did I have these? I think I had these down on the side. Okay. So, some may write. Because I did just pull all this stuff out of this purse. And now that I'm trying to stick it back in there, it is not giving me a good close like it did the first time. It is acting like it don't want to close, as a matter of fact. Which is weird because, as y'all saw, it was closed. I didn't have too much of anything in those front pockets, though. So maybe that is where the problem is coming in at. No, what did I do different? I can't get it closed now, y'all. Everything is back in here like it was for the most part. Maybe even neater. So I'm trying to understand why it won't close but as y'all saw the bag was closed you know i didn't have to force it like i'm doing right now it was closed so that is it that is all inside of my myers brand bag uh this is a true 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 bougie on a budget bag it looks good to me i'm gonna wear it with confidence and if you're trying to pass it off as a YSL, just keep it turned like that. I mean, I don't know. I'm going to wear it like this with the flap showing. Because I want people to know it's not a YSL. So when I be like, oh, girl, where you get that bag from? I'm going to be like, Myers. And this is just called Chevron uh, Quilting. And it is really cute. <clears throat> so, guys, that is it. That is all for me. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you suck at doing brows like me, go check out I Met the Beauty and get you a little brow stamp and let you know with some stencils or just go get some stencils i don't know whichever one you want to do but as you saw it had a nice little arch on my hand and you saw my pictures so thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up and don't forget to hit subscribe if you haven't already done so bye y'all